God will take care of your family if you focus on God. But God will take you to America, not Canada. Even opportunity came, but because you were too focused on family, family issue, family issue, family issue, distraction. Before you know it, you, you lose focus. Wow, 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 wow. It was a powerful prophetic encounter. God demonstrating his tremendous power and might with the prophetic realm through prophetess and this prophetic encounter left the Cuban surgeon astonished. But this is not a surprise because with God, nothing is hidden. For our case file is so widely open before the face and the table of God. Through the power and the anointing of God, Prophetess Anne revealed to the Cuban lady her past, her present, and her future according to God's plan. The lady was astonished and surprised because Prophetess Anne told her deep secret about her family and the wrong choices she has made that had delayed God's plan in her life. She advised her to focus on God and not her problem. And she should stop counting the days because God understands. The Cuban surgeon was so worried and disturbed about the limit of her time that she has to stay in Canada and a job opportunity that she is looking forward to get. But the woman of God, Prophetess Anne, revealed to her the deep plans of the Lord concerning her future. That her future is not even in Canada, it's in the United States of America, that she is a brilliant woman. And she is one strong hand in her family, thus for that reason she will encounter so many attacks. But she should fix her eyes on God's plan and God's purpose in her life. And in God's timing, everything will be beautiful. The situation in, in Cuba is really hard. You know, it's one locked country. And situation, economical situation in Cuba is very hard. So, I, 10 years ago, I go Haiti to bring my, uh, my um, as a professional. Uh, and everything was okay. I was working with Haitian people. But uh, just now, situation is very hard. And I come in to visit my cousin here in Canada with one hope, because here, uh, uh, say, Canada needs some professor. I am doctor. I am surgeon, general surgeon. Okay. And uh, I come in here to see if I, I find one possibility to work here in this country. So... Um, is that my now my situation? I because I have three months here, justly to me, and I would like to find before return. Because if I return, I need to go to to Haiti again. Haiti is very hard country, but uh, now it's little. It's more hard because violence, kidnapping, and murder, and situation now is out of control. So I would like to go out, but I cannot come back to Cuba uh, because how I go to give my family food? I need to take one one way. I need to one choice. Can I tell you something now? Yeah. Um, you do you you? I know it's not easy. You're a medical doctor. And even in your house, in your family, you are the only one with a good job as a medical doctor. Every other person is not up to you too, with your career. You are the only one. That is why you seem to be the pillar of the house. So, but don't try too hard. Don't try too hard. Don't be too hard on yourself. Because it's making you depressed now. You keep counting each day. God is not counting your success. God wants
want you to focus on him. You have a calling to serve people. You understand? You have a calling to help people with your career. God will take care of your family if you focus on God. So don't be too hard on yourself. I need to feed my family. God can provide help from everywhere, but God will take you to America, not Canada. All your life, you wanted to go to America to to do this job. You wanted to. Even opportunity came, but because you were too focused on family, family issue, family issue, family issue, distraction. Before you know it, you you lose focus. Sper, istru prim. Yeah, somebody sent me to go to America, and only a little resistance, you know, because and my father never liked to. Our family for United States, but everybody. You see, but that, but that is where God wants you to be. That is why you keep struggling here. You struggle in Haiti. You struggle in Canada. Your your greatness is in America. So don't. If you look at people say this, my father say this, because you listen to your family. You don't listen to God. You have to listen to God now. Okay. God will make a way for you to America. Amen, amen, amen. Wow. Just focus on him now, okay? When you enter operation, when you as a surgeon, when you go in, you know what you need to do. You are very brilliant. You are very, very brilliant. So Your your gift, you are wasting it everywhere, wasting it, wasting your gift. Whereas America is waiting for you, looking for you. Wow, primi. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Santo Padre. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button as a way to support the channel. We are grateful for all your efforts.